Welcome back. There is a twist in Scarlet murder case. An Israeli boy named Shanti has figured in the case. It's two and a half years now and this new suspect has surfaced. Meanwhile, Scarlett's mother Fiona McOwen was cross-examined in the children's court on Friday. Her cross-examination will continue on Monday. Fiona McOwen is in Goa for Scarlett murder case. She was cross-examined in children's court on Friday. The defence lawyer raised doubt on the age of Scarlett killing. He also said that her passport is not admissible to determine the age of the deceased. The case was heard before the children's court judge P.V. Savoykar. There is another angle in the case. Name of an Israeli boy named Shanti has surfaced in the case. Almost after two and a half years, this new name has come up from a witness in the case. Is there something new that you saw before today which you have I haven't said anything today that I haven't said all along, really. Well, they had certain questions which they needed to verify about uh, her stay, where all she went, etc., which she has clarified even to the defence. But the cross-examination is to continue. A reporter in Panji Lokik Shilkar with video journalist Ravindra Dalvi. Fatada MLA Damodar Naik slammed government for not being serious about reverting back the land from SZ developers. He also questioned why government has failed to revert land from unnotified SEZ developers. Opposition also asked government to bring it to the notice of High Court to drop the names of four unnotified SEZ developers from the petition. Government has a clear intention of withdrawing this land from them. In fact, we have brought it to the notice of the High Court also that this some cases which you are mentioning, these four cases of out of uh, seven, these four cases are not notified SEZs. But problem is they were approved that time by the board of approval. No. This, this four. No. The last one was even not approved. No, no, but they had, there are. See your annexure. Based on, based on that, no, no. See it was your annexure. You have yourself given reply. It was not that notified. The last one, uh, seventh one is not approved, Munun. Max, Max Pro. Ek, ek approved kor mahil last. So, where is the question? If he is not approved, uh, if he has got land, he cannot develop it. He has to give back the land. So, Max Pro quota no yon na slow. I have actually every two months or three months I am writing a letter also. I am reminding them. I am I have called on the minister personally. La, la, speaker sir, last week Mr. Anand Sharma has told me after the Speaker sir, Mr. Anand Sharma has told me that after after the parliament session he will call a meeting in Delhi and try to thresh it out. A principal correspondent Murari Shetty Apana Gaundalkar with video journalist Anil Sanadi. Opposition grilled government for not being able to control illegal iron ore exports from ports in Goa. Mapsa MLA Francis D'Souza pointed out that iron ore exports of almost 4,000 crore rupees are carried out from Goan ports. Opposition leader Manohar Parikar demanded criminal case against MPT chairman. Praveen Agarwal for allowing illegal iron ore export from MPT. Chief Minister Digambar Kamath informed House about the corrective measures government has taken. Go on over 2007-8, 33.43 million tons of export zala. 2008-2009, 38.07 million tons. And 2009-10, 46.22 million tons. Ani produce sala 2007 8 30.51, 8 no 32.76, Ani no da 41.04. Producer production and exporter million ton, no da 5.18 million ton. The value speaker says, Sangta Duga, Sadaran she, Sat at no she, 
कोटी आठ नौ दीड हजार कोटी नौ दा मध्य सोलाश कोटी ये फर्क कहो ये लास्ट टाइम आई एश्योर दीज हाउस दैट वी आर अंडरटेकिंग द वेरिफिकेशन ऑफ ऑल द लीज होल्डर्स बेस्ड ऑन दैट दैट प्रोसेस हेज ऑल्सो स्टार्टेड वी हैव ऑलरेडी वेरीफाइड अराउंड सिक्सटी पर्सेंट ऑफ द लीज होल्डर्स एंड वी हैव रिकवर्ड अराउंड वन क्रोर ऑफ रुपीज फ्रॉम दैम वी हैव नाउ गॉट ऑल द डॉक्यूमेंट्स फ्रॉम द कस्टम्स ऑफ एक्सपोर्ट फिगर्स वी हैव ऑलरेडी चेकिंग ऑफ द एक्सपोर्टर्स फिगर्स टेलिंग इट एंड दोज दैट वेर एवर देर इज डिफरेंस वी आर सेंडिंग दैम नोटिसज टू रिकवर द रॉयल्टी प्रवीण अगरवाला इश्यू करूं लाइक क्राइम ब्रांच की केस फाइल कर तक आप हंगा क्राइम ब्रांचीन आनी जो सो पे बाकी बसयता पे आठ वर बस काम जो दुसरे दिस आई वील कीप दीज इन माइंड इफ दे फेल टू एक्सिट टू आवर डायरेक्शन ओके स्पीकर सर वन मोर थिंग डायरेक्शन भी शब्द टू टू चेक द मुमेंट ऑफ द इलिगल ओर आ प्रिंसिपल कॉरेस्पॉन्डंट मुरारी शेटी अपर्णा गौंडलकार विथ वीडियो जर्नलिस्ट अनिल सनदी A 10-year-old four-wheeler turned into ashes at Panji. Short circuit is in the air conditioner is suspected to be the reason behind this incident. Loss is yet to be estimated. A car caught fire in Panji on Friday. The reason of the incident is assumed to be short circuit in the air conditioner. The car registered as GA01S 4496 is owned by Mario Norona the loss is yet to be estimated so ac sun spark hello and uh, spark pon open kele ani battery disconnect kele ani battery disconnect korche pole zaun soglo uza petlo ani short circuit short dala oi short dala sli through the ac fire brigade reached at the site and controlled the fire only the skeleton of the car was left पाइप यूज करते पड़े आम फोम भर दौरल पैसे जो पेट्रोल के तसले नसले हाई प्रेसर तो अंडर कंट्रोल आ चालू भयंकर चालू आसल एकदम हाँ गाड़ी साइटी आसल आ रिपोर्टर फ्रॉम पणजी देविदास कंबड़ी विद वीडियो जर्नलिस्ट सुशांत पड़ हाई कोर्ट हेज डिस्मिस द केस फाइल बाय नोट अगेन्स्ट अमिताभ बच्चन The judgment has come almost after four years. General Secretary of Note, Dr. Shekhar Salkar, informed that the organisation will move to the Supreme Court for justice. Note had filed a case against the veteran actor Amitabh Bachchan some four to five years ago. Amitabh was seen advertising with a cigarette, which is against the law. High Court recently dismissed the case filed by Note against the actor. Dr. Shekhar Salkar said that he will ascertain the facts as to on what basis. the case was dismissed he will move to the supreme court for justice high court has dismissed our case against abida bachchan but we think the details have not come as yet we have just said that the case is dismissed so we want to know exactly for what basis uh, court has given for dismissal of this case but i am quite sure there is a very strong case made out against mr abida bachchan and others and uh, in case the once the proper order comes then we will study it and i would like to move to the supreme court on this issue